Well, it's time now for yeah, hashtag right. watch this. Good morning, Joe. How are you, man? Good. Well, listen, I I'm not sure that anyone could be more excited for someone to be pregnant than the new grandparents. Uh, this woman, she might win the prize. Watch this. Not the kind I want. I feel like that's what my mom would do. Yes. <laughs> you know, my mom almost had the same reaction when I was like, yeah, my wife and I are pregnant. Did you guys do a surprise or you just kind of told her right out? We told her right out. What well, we did, we sent a picture. And they were like, what is this? <laughs> oh, Freddie, that's similar to what we did. We had a picture oh. frame wrapped uh -huh. up of my wife uh, holding the ultrasound and gave the picture frame. Aww. So when they unwrapped it, they were like, well, you know, so. That's Aww. cute. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that that woman was hysterical for like what? Thirty seconds. She's like, "What? What's this bun in the oven? You know, what, what's Who's this?" Toasting bread. Yeah, <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> that was really cute. Thanks so much, Joe. And it's time for our favorite part of the day. Hashtag Watch This. Good morning, Joe. Good morning. Now, uh, Freddie, you're mostly uh, clean shaven. Yeah. Uh, He's got a little. A little, little, little something. Yeah. yeah. Well, listen, we clean a lot of things: desks, floors, windows, toilets. But do men clean their beards? A TV station in New Mexico took a swab to the beards of a handful of men, and the results showed some beards are just as dirty as toilets. I think you were correct when wow. you said dirty as toilets. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, uh, 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 these are our friends and coworkers. These are not people who have uh, been in this survey. But according to TV stations, uh, the st several of the beards contained a lot of normal bacteria. But some were comparable to toilets. Believe it or not, the study found that if, <laughs> if the city were to find similar samples in their water system, it would need to be shut down for disinfecting. Oh, no. Oh. So what does that mean for your beard? Oh. Well, some of the bacteria <laughs> won't lead to illness, but it's pretty disturbing um, what they yeah. found. So if you have a beard, they say you need to scrub the beard a little more thoroughly than you probably do, and then wash your hands a lot. Oh. Think about it. When you take a shower, if you have a beard, you, you might You kinda, don't shampoo your beard. Well, you probably get the, the, the outskirts of the beard, but you're not actually getting inside the beard. You know what I'm saying? Well, like, like you do with cool. your hair. Yeah, you, like you scrub it, you put shampoo, right. sometimes conditioner, and technically, for some people, it's the same amount of hair on the top of their head. You should... Lather yeah. it up. Now, for over right. a decade, I had a goatee, and I actually would make sure that I scrubbed it with shampoo. That's you didn't want to be a poop face? Yeah. <laughs> well, this changed the status of, like, you know, no shave November now. You know, well, when guys oh, grow the beard? Exactly. As long as guys can clean their beards effectively. Uh, no shave November. I think it's Just still going to... Just make gonna, sure you wash yeah. it. Like, put the... Wash your beard do you have the guys... Do you no. have the picture of the guy with the snow in his beard? Can, can we see that one more time? If snow can gather like that, yeah, see, that's imagine what, I'm talking what about. else can. Mm. If, if, we have, if we have enough stuff that can actually gather inside of our beard... Yeah. That's where the issue is. And, and I like yeah. beards. I think they look great, you know. Mm. Well, that, that, rug, that rugged now look. I look like <laughs> really gross yeah, see out. that? There it is. But I mean, that, to me, that it gets, well. Oh. Yeah, but you don't have, like, you know, dirty things just blowing in the wind like snow does. I mean, yeah. yes, there's bacteria in the air, but, you know. Well, like, they mm. say, I, and I don't want to get too <sighs> gross this morning, but they say pretty much anything within a three to four foot radius of your toilet. Mm -hmm. has the chance to get contaminated. Well, because when you flush, so they've done scientific yes. studies that shows that it goes a certain range. Yes. Yeah. So if you have, like, a small bathroom, you need to make sure your t your toothbrush, toothbrush has a cap on it Absolutely. or it's in the sink, because otherwise that's it's spreading. All and beards that. are within no. that radius. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Joe, thank you so yeah. much, man. The more man. you know. <laughs> I'm disgusted. Star. Yeah. G.I. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Stay with us, you guys. We'll be back in just a minute. Oh.